So the African Centre for Migration and Society is uh, an Africa-based uh, research centre in um, migration. Um, we were initially, we were founded in 2001 as a studies programme, as a master's programme at the University of the Wittwartersrand here in Johannesburg. Um, and then we uh, gradually developed into a research programme. We are now about 20 staff members, based, uh, all of us based here. Um, from um, junior researchers to uh, professors, senior researchers, etc. A few um, support, uh, support staff. Um, and we cover the whole range of uh, migration studies. Uh, we have a number of programs that look at migration and urban developments, uh, programs looking at the migration and public health, um, as well as programs that look at uh, migration and policy developments, not only in South Africa, but in Southern Africa and beyond. Um, and we have uh, different partnerships um, in Southern Africa as well as across the world. So we've been working with the French Institute of South Africa for seven years now, since 2005. Um, this um, grew from a collaboration uh, essentially between um, researchers here who had been working on migration essentially from a human rights perspective uh, in the early um, 2000s and researchers from France who had worked on various aspects of migration um, some of whom, like myself, were already involved in um, studies of um, migration policy development in post-apartheid South Africa, but others from um, different research organizations in France who had worked on uh, migration um, and changes in migration policies, for instance, and the impact of the European uh, migration uh, policy on North African countries. So there was a mutual interest for um, expanding those exchanges and trying to um, develop very strong linkages. And this initially started with uh, a collaboration around a French uh, program which was called FSP, uh, looking at international migration and um, urban transformation uh, in various parts of the African continent. So that's how the collaboration between the French Institute and this research unit at WIT started. This program was uh, run between 2006 and 2009 um, and um, this really um, helped us build those very strong linkages. A number of publications came out of this. We also developed linkages with colleagues uh, across Africa, with Mozambique, with uh, the Democratic Republic of Congo. Um, it was a very fruitful program that strengthened um, those, uh, those uh, research linkages. So we, we then had a second research collaboration which was very important, uh, which was called uh, MITRANS. Uh, this was uh, funded by the National Research Agency in France, uh, and it was a collaboration between uh, the French Research Unit URMIS, um, coordinated by a colleague um, of, of ours there, Jocelyne Streffinard, the director of URMIS, and myself looking at uh, transit migration in Africa. Um, this program stemmed from the realization that uh, the policies put in place, in particular by the European Union uh, on the Euro -Mediterranean, um, in the Euro-Mediterranean area, and to a lesser extent, but with a number of similarities by South Africa in Southern Africa, um, had a number of implications in terms of the development of migration policies in uh, those neighboring countries, uh, in terms of the transformation of transit uh, areas, transit cities, transit, transit towns, as well as in terms of migrant subjectivities and migrant trajectories and migrant uh, projects. So um, we then moved into other collaborations and it's been a very fruitful area of collaboration between the French Institute and um, this research unit, but also other colleagues in, in uh, South Africa and beyond. Um, we developed a specific uh, research project that was looking at mobility and the urban space, thanks to uh, funding from the uh, Institute of Research for Development, IRD. Um, and this ran between 2008 and 2010. 